Hello everyone. Welcome to the Gifts of God channel. We wish you all a blessed and fruitful day. May God bless all those who are watching this video. There will be a major event attracting the attention of millions worldwide. The Blessed Mother has recently sent a profound message to Mirjana, warning us about the events about to unfold on the Day of Fallen Angels. It sounds intriguing and somewhat frightening. This could be a dreadful day as evil forces may attempt to interfere with our lives on Earth, and the boundaries between realms may become blurred. People are mentally preparing for what could be a historically chaotic event and significant losses. Many are becoming anxious and tense as the day draws near. We hope you will enjoy the video and subscribe to this YouTube channel to stay updated with the latest information. Join us and listen to this video until the very end. Type Amen if you believe, may God bless you all. Before delving into today's topic, let us offer a prayer to Mother Mary. Dear Mother Mary, you are the beloved daughter of God the Father, I entrust my soul under your care. Protect the life of God within my soul. Do not let me lose that life because of sin. Please safeguard my mind and will so that all my thoughts and desires may be pleasing to God. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee, blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and in the hour of our death. Amen. There is a vast distance between the human realm and the angelic realm. This distance maintains a state of balance. However, over time, angels began to dispute and fight amongst themselves. Some angels rebelled against others because they grew weary of adhering to the rules. These rebellious angels were cast out of heaven and fell to earth as a consequence of their disobedience. It seems like shooting stars illuminating the sky as they fall. Their impact causes the earth to tremble and leaves permanent scars. Everywhere is filled with horror and darkness as these fallen angels descend upon the earth. People discuss what has happened and the stories related to these fallen angels from the sky. While some believe they may bring about change, the majority fear the issues they might create. Additionally, there have been reports from Saint Mick of a message from the Blessed Mother. Nothing will remain as it was, everything will change. Therefore, beloved children of the King in Jesus Christ, our Queen and Mother, we advise you to become less worldly and live more holily to use your discernment to escape the demons. Once shining and holy, the fallen angels now wander the planet, their presence shrouding everything in dark clouds. Do not be swayed by fear, for your faith will serve as a barrier against adversity. Realize that while the fallen angels seek to create conflict and chaos, they are mere shadows fleeting in the eternal light of heaven's grace. There will be a kingdom where angels live high in the sky in the distant future. They will always be radiant and lovely, bringing joy wherever they go. But ultimately, some angels will become resentful and crave greater power. These angels will fall, their once bright wings now turn black. The earth will quake as they touch down, leaving deep and permanent scars. Fear will accompany them, making everything grim and terrifying. Whispers of strange lights and angels falling from the sky will come from the people on earth. While some fear what they may achieve, others believe they can bring about change. However, amidst the horror, some brave souls will confront the darkness, proving that strength and hope can exist even in the direst circumstances. Ultimately, after a fierce battle between good and evil, the fallen angels will be defeated. The earth will not only be scarred but also a constant reminder that there is always light to help us through difficult times. Thus, the day of fallen angels descending upon the earth will continue to exist in the centuries to come as a story of courage and hope. There will be a great flood of blood and darkness as the land collapses on earth. The descent of the fallen angels from the sky will coincide with a horrific event unprecedented on earth. A tide of blood fury will accompany them, spreading uncontrollably across the land with unstoppable force. As fiery streaks pierce through the clouds, heralding the approaching fallen angels, the sky will darken to a terrifying extent. However, it seems like the earth is trembling in pain, blood from all cracks and crevices. 
The red tide will erupt and engulf entire towns and cities. Buildings will collapse and be swept away by the flood, turning the streets red with thick, viscous fluid. The once peaceful waters of lakes and rivers will turn into infamous rivers of blood due to the indescribable agony that will befall the earth. Amidst the chaos and despair, humanity will be paralyzed and unable to comprehend the magnitude of the disaster they are witnessing. People will flee in terror as the relentless tide approaches, and horrifying screams will echo throughout the air. However, within the tragedy, there will be rays of hope. From the chaos, brave spirits will rise, willing to sacrifice their lives to save others. The congregation, children of our King and Jesus Christ, are still changing. The civil of God is becoming confused by these changes, and as a result, some have lost faith and abandoned the congregation. You have my eternal love, protection, and blessings. According to Jude 1 verse 6, And the angels who did not keep their own domain, but abandoned their proper abode, he has kept in eternal bonds under darkness for the judgment of the great day. The text suggests that these angels, who abandoned their home in heaven and disrupted the natural order, are now held in eternal darkness, where they will be judged on the last day. This statement emphasizes the importance of disobedience and the significance of maintaining one's rightful position within the sacred hierarchical system. It is a cautionary tale about pride and disobedience, highlighting the consequences of deviating from God's plan. It also underscores the idea of divine justice, wherein those who do not obey God's commandments ultimately pay the price for their actions. Now let us unite in prayer. O, oh, holy angels, whom the Almighty has entrusted with our protection, guidance, shelter, and defense tonight from all evil and danger. Lord, save us from sleep and keep us awake so that we may keep watch with Christ and sleep in peace. Amen. Thank you for watching until the end of the video. What do you think about today's topic? Leave your comments below and don't forget to subscribe to the channel, hit the bell icon to receive notifications of the latest videos. In conclusion, I wish you all a day filled with positive energy. May God bless you. Amen.